These posters from communist Cuba display cultural references from around the world. Stony Brook art history professors are uncovering how these images made their way into the island's revolutionary propaganda. With their bright colors and mesmerizing designs, each print tells a story. At a roundtable discussion held at the Zucker Gallery's latest exhibition, Printing Solidarity, Professors Sol Lee, Barbara Frank, and Lorena Salcedo Watson shared their extensive research to bring these stories to life. Founded in Havana, Cuba in 1966, the Organization of Solidarity with the People of Asia, Africa, and Latin America developed to reject westernization and imperialism. Hundreds of posters were produced for widespread distribution in the group's magazine, Tricontinental, often mixing recognizable traditional icons with themes of violence to promote camaraderie, socialism, and reclaiming cultural identity. These posters, they speak to a particular moment in time of the 1960s. Um, as I said, this was a time of incredible optimism um, and uh, uh, an experimentation, nation building. While the posters reimagined historical artworks, they continue to push boundaries today. For Stony Brook Media Group, I'm Justin Mitzelmaker.